Welcome to The Eclectic Thrifter and Crafter, where we thrift and craft with purpose. Hey, it's still snowing here. A few days before Christmas and another project. Today we're going to be making Russian tea. I'm going to be doubling the recipe. I'll put the recipe in the description. It is less stressful if you have all your materials ready and waiting for you. Again, this is not a new idea. This is a recipe that my mother made for Christmas when I was young. It was very popular when my older brother was in college in the 60s. My girlfriend Patty had the same recipe. She was kind enough to share it with me. I do not put any extra sugar in this recipe. There's plenty of sugar in the tea the lemonade and the tang as well. I will leave it in the recipe in the description. It is certainly up to you whether you want to put that extra sugar in or not. I hope it's been a lovely holiday for you all so far. It's been busy for me. I've been making all my gifts. And now we're getting ready to put in the spices. So first we have our cloves. I've measured out one tablespoon already. And this is the allspice. And that's the cinnamon. And I do go back and put in the other tablespoon of cloves. I found that using my mixer to mix the powders thoroughly works the best, even though it does get a little dusty. Just put it on the lowest speed to mix all the ingredients well. If you're a thrifter as I am, you'll have run across these lovely jars. Pick them up when you can, and this way you'll have them ready when you make your own gifts. Filled with chocolates or special teas, such as this Russian tea, they really do make lovely presentations. And this is just how simple making this Russian tea recipe is. I hope you've enjoyed your time with me today. Please like, subscribe, share the Thrifting and Crafting channel with your Thrifting and Crafting friends. Please hit the notification button for future announcements for thrifts and crafts. Please share in the comments below and tell me what your favorite recipe is for the Christmas holidays. 
I hope to see you tomorrow for Tea Tuesday. I have a special recipe planned. But most of all, have a lovely, lovely day. And a merry and happy Christmas.